you guys, it's Jasmine. Today I'm going to be filming my May favorites. Basically, it's just everything that I've been loving this month. I have a bunch of beauty favorites and then I have just a few like random favorites. So I guess let's get started. My first beauty favorite is the Maybelline Dream Fresh BB Cream. I just recently purchased a BB cream because I normally only wear foundation, but I really wanted something a little bit lighter for summer. And this definitely does it. It's tinted, so it has a little bit of um, color to it, so you can kind of cover up some redness because we don't, we don't all want that. But it's really light and it has SPF, which I love because you know summer is all about being in the sun and going to the beach. So I've really been loving this product. My next beauty favorite is actually an eyeliner. It's the L'Oreal Paris Super Slim Infallible Liquid Eyeliner. Normally I use the Maybelline Line Stiletto and it was basically the first liquid eyeliner that I've ever owned. And so I didn't really know there was anything better out there, which I know, it sounds crazy, but I kept having to shake it up all the time, every time I went to put it on. It was always super watery and like I had to put on like five coats and it was just the brush was really really small and the handle was really small so it was like it was just really difficult to put on and I I saw a commercial on TV the other day for the um, infallible pen and I figured I'd try it out and this is seriously the best eyeliner I've ever owned it's just it's just a really great eyeliner and it's perfect and it's easy to put on and that's that's all I really want. My next beauty products are hair products. I've kind of been trying out a lot of new hair products lately because my hair's been kind of, kind of bothering me. Recently, I've been looking for a more natural, like, shampoo or conditioner instead of, you know, getting herbal essences all the time, which does smell amazing, but I've heard, you know, there's so much crap in those shampoos and they just, you know, they dry out your hair and my hair was starting to get really brittle and it was breaking easily and it was thin and so I just wanted to try something a little bit natural. So I picked up the Nourishing Coconut Milk Shampoo and Conditioner. I got these from Target. They're really cheap. They're like, I think they're like around six bucks, which is really good for a fancy conditioner, I guess, if you call this fancy. But I've kind of been having an obsession with coconut. I, abs I absolutely hate coconut, like more than anything, but the smell of it, I love the smell of coconut. That's the only thing I like about it. It makes my hair really smooth and silky, which is what I want, you know, and it looks healthy. If it may not be the most healthiest hair in the world, at least it looks like it is, and that's, that's all I really care about. So my next hair favorite is actually an oil. This is the Suave Professionals Moroccan Infusion. So I picked up this, I really like it. It's really easy to put on and that's pretty much why I bought it. For now, this is working really well. It makes my hair really, really shiny and smooth, but it doesn't look too oily. You just put it on the bottoms of your hair, like right here, you know, when you're done styling or before you're done styling, it kind of protects it from the heat as well as kind of making all the frizz go away. Really been loving this. It's my first weirdly random favorite, which isn't even like, new at all is the Tide to Go pen. In case you guys haven't noticed, I have white bedding that I bought at Ikea and it was kind of expensive and it was just a fancy pretty white duvet and I really love it. I have a puppy and I have a habit of eating in bed so I can't encourage you more to have a Tide to Go pen on your bedside table if you have white bedding. So my next random favorite I don't have with me but I'm going to get one after this. It is the Twix Frappuccino from Starbucks. It is um, a caramel frappuccino with extra caramel, pump of hazelnut, as well as java chips, which are the little chocolate chips that go in there. I like to have heavy whipping cream instead of milk just because it makes it a little more ice creamy and a little less icy. And then when it's done, you just top it off with mocha drizzle, which is the chocolate syrup, as well as the caramel syrup. It is just the most delicious, chocolatey, caramelly, Thing you could even like fathom and it's perfect. Right, so that's it for my May favorite. I'll mention all of the products that I have talked about today down in the down bar. So, upcoming, this prom is this weekend and I was thinking about filming a get ready with me for prom about how I'm doing my hair and my makeup and what I'm wearing. Make sure you thumbs up this video if you want me to upload that getting ready with me for prom video. So, don't forget to subscribe and thank you guys for watching. I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye.